Now let's examine how we multiply complex numbers. We're going to focus on using FOIL for binomial multiplication and we're going to establish a general rule for multiplying complex numbers. So we're going to start with using FOIL for binomial multiplication. FOIL means the firsts. O for outers, I for inners, and L for the lasts. So let's start with this. So the we're going to use FOIL. So using FOIL. We have first will be 2 times 5. Plus two times negative six i plus five times three i plus three i times negative six i. So we have ten minus twelve i plus fifteen i minus eighteen i squared. So this is 10 plus 3i minus 18 multiplied by a negative 1. So this is 10 plus 3i plus 18. And then we have 10 plus 18 plus 3i, which is 28 plus 3i. Now let's take a look at this one. We're also using FOIL. We have minus i minus 3 plus minus i and then 2i plus minus 1 multiplied by minus 3 plus minus 1 multiplied by 2i. Minus i times minus 3, that's going to give us 3i. Minus i times 2i, that's minus 2i squared. Minus 1 times minus 3, that's plus 3. Minus 1 times 2i minus 2i. So let's look at grouping common terms. So we have 3i minus 2i minus 2 multiplied by minus 1 plus 3. So this is going to give us i plus 2 plus 3. And we're going to have i plus 5. So let's write it in, let's write it in a plus b i. So this is going to be 5 plus i. Now let's look at this 3 plus 4 i squared. So 3 plus 4 i squared is 3 plus 4 i and then 3 plus 4i. Let's use FOIL here. So this is 3 times 3 plus 3 times 4i plus 4i times 3 plus 4i times 4i. So this is going to give us 9 plus 12i plus 12i plus 16i squared. So 9 plus 24i plus 16 multiplied by negative 1. So this is going to give us 9 minus 16 plus 24i. This is going to give us negative 7 plus 24i. And that is the solution. 
let's look at this one here I'm going to use this method a plus b squared equal to a squared plus 2ab plus b squared so 5 minus 7i squared is 5 squared minus 2 times 5 times 7i plus 7i squared. So this is 25 minus 70i plus 49i squared. So this is 25 minus 70i plus 49 multiplied by a negative 1. So this is 25 plus... So 25 minus 49 minus 70i. So negative 24 minus 70i. Now let's look at the general rule for determining the product of two binomial, two complex numbers. And when we, we're going to use the FOIL method, and when we simplify, we can see that A plus BI multiplied by C plus DI is going to give us A times C minus B times D plus a times D plus B times C multiplied by I. So let's apply the same approach here. So A is equal to 6, B equal to negative 4, C equal to 2, and D equal to negative 1. So 6 minus 4i multiplied by 2 minus i should give us ac, so that's 6 times 2 minus bd minus 4 times minus 1 plus i ad minus 1 times minus times six plus B C minus four times two. Okay, so six times two is twelve minus four plus I minus one times six is minus six minus four times 2 is minus 8. So this is going to give us 8 plus i times negative 14. So this is going to be 8 minus 14i. Let's check that against using FOIL just to see if this works. This is going to give us Let's label this as FOIL. This is going to give us 6 times 2 plus 6 times negative i plus 2 times negative 4i plus negative 4i times negative i. So this is 12 minus 6i minus 8i minus 4i squared. Ah, that's plus 4i squared. So that's going to give us 12 minus 14i minus 4. So that's going to give us 8 minus 14i. So it works. 
Finally, let's apply the same method here. A is equal to 9, B equal to negative 7, C equal to 4, and D equal to 3. So, 9 minus 7i multiplied by 4 plus 3i is going to give us AC 9 times 4 minus BD negative 7 times 3 plus I we have AD 9 times 3 plus BC negative 7 times 4. So 9 times 4 is 36 minus negative 21 plus I we have 9 times 3 27 minus 28. So this is going to give us 57 minus I. Let's double check with FOIL using FOIL we have 9 times 4 plus 9 times 3i plus 4 times negative 7i plus negative 7i times 3i. So 9 times 4 is 36 plus 27i minus 28i minus 21i squared. So 36 minus i plus 21 is going to give us 57 minus i.